Bow. What's up everybody? Once again, it's Brand Man Sean and today we're gonna talk about why everybody loves Cardi B. If I had to just say it in two words, I would just say her personality, but we're gonna get a little bit deeper than that. This level of success all goes back to her personality, which can one, start with her level of authenticity. The first moment you hear Cardi B speak, usually you can see how authentic she is. When she gets asked questions in interviews about her body, she's way more open than a lot of these women have been. And I just can't change myself completely into a person that I won't even know. Mm -hmm. You know, like, for example, everybody used to talk about my teeth, right? All right, I fixed them. Now everybody want to talk about my fake boobs. I'm not going to switch that because if I switch that, that's me taking away something that makes me happy. My boobs make me happy. I love my boobs. Um, <laughs> Like, people, a lot of people is like, all right, Cardi, you're in a different platform. You need to talk and act a, a different way. If I talk a different way, I won't feel like myself. Mm. Even her song that's of course blowing up, Bodak Yellow. Probably heard of me. Got a bag and fix my teeth. Hope you hoes no ain't cheap. That line right there is her version of Biggie Smalls. Heart throb never. Black and ugly as ever. However, I say Gucci down to the socks. Ooh, that's still cold. Not only can people relate because a lot of times they have their own shortcomings, they can also respect it because they recognize that so many celebrities are hiding a lot of things. I mean, we've already seen clearly that Kim and Nicki have butt implants, but they won't ever talk about it or act like it hasn't been done. Not to mention other people things with eyes and lips and noses, all these things that people are getting done. And then she takes that feeling of authenticity a whole nother level deeper when she talks about her past as a stripper and the fact that she was stripping was to escape domestic violence from her boyfriend um living with his mama two pit bulls in a bedroom it was crazy i'm not gonna tell her story because it's for her to tell and she has told it so i'll put a link or two in the description below but all i can say if you haven't seen it is the way she talks about her past she doesn't try to push herself as a victim or a superhero she simply describes the things that she went through and her thought process and the logical steps for her at the time that she took to do what she felt that she needed to do and giving us insight and understanding of that rise that she's taken and seeing the rise that she is still on it positions her as an underdog and who doesn't like to root for an underdog I know plenty of people who know nothing about the sports don't watch but whenever that championship happens at the end of the year next thing you know they just say which team does everybody think is gonna lose I'm gonna just go for them and then you add the fact that this woman is a straight-up character sitting on a guy's face right and he was doing such a good job girl I got carried away and I put my whole weight on him bitch I broke his nose we had to go to the hospital and say somebody jumped him <laughs> <laughs> now, do you still enjoy McDonald's breakfast? Or are you fancy now? <laughs> oh my God, today I ate a bacon, egg, and cheese, but from Starbucks. So I guess I'm moving on up, guys. <laughs> I'm moving on up, okay? She's funny, she's crazy, and she's always depicting that to the people, not just in interviews, but she's always talking directly to the people through Instagram, Snapchat, and she does it in a real personal way. It's not super staged, which makes her even more fun to watch. Cardi just seems fun to actually be around. All of this, and I'm still yet to mention the fact that she's a sex symbol. But that's because it doesn't matter anywhere near as much as a lot of the brands that female artists have created for themselves in the past. The stereotypical core fan base for a lot of successful female artists are other women and gay men. And then the straight males are expected to be less invested and more so just sexually objectify them. But the thing about Cardi is the fact that she has the things that I already mentioned, but when you just package that and the fun personality she already has as a person that just seems like someone you would want to hang around with, you get male support that you really don't see too much for a lot of female artists. As a matter of fact, check out this comment that Charlamagne the God had at the VMAs. And then this clip of ASAP Ferg at the Breakfast Club. What do you think about the new guys like the a boogies, even Cardi B. Oh man, I I don't know why I'm so excited about Cardi B, but <laughs> we all are. Every time, every time I see her, I just want to give her a big hug, and like I just man, because I I know where she come from, and you know it's hard, like you know and she doesn't hide her excitement. She don't try to be cool about it. No, and sometimes <laughs> she go on a camera without makeup. Right, like, I love she, it. Yeah, I watched something on YouTube. It was like when she went live on Instagram and she was just talking about like how how she like she hate the fame shit like how she just wish everything go back regular I think she was in Dubai or something like this and she was just like 
She just real. That wasn't politically correct excitement. You could tell that he's genuinely excited and interested in Cardi. And so many people have shared that same sentiment, but it's a lot less expected from the males. As a matter of fact, my brother who's seven years older than me texted me to got a bag and fix my teeth line by Cardi B, talking about this the new gospel and she be snapping. I can't remember a time in my life when my brother's ever texting me anybody's lyrics. That's the power of Cardi's personality, her authenticity, and all that that comes along with it. Of course, on top of the great moves that her team has made. That's it. Y'all know what to do. Hit that subscribe button.